When you come out to somewhere like Napa, that's a very different setting for many of us. And I think it, it does something to, to how we think, um, what we're willing to open up about perhaps. And you know, you're in wine country and um, who doesn't open up a little bit more with a, with a glass of wine? We've had so many faculty, program directors, risk managers who've reached out and said, can we come to your programs as learners? Not as faculty, but as learners because we want to learn what you're teaching the students and residents. So we're really excited in that we could start offering these programs to those program directors and to those faculty members who really want to understand why the safety of our patients and our associates at the front lines is so important. In today's world, in the way that we have 400,000 deaths a year, we have medical errors, our faculty has to embrace an indifferent kind of learning, which means that they have to learn things before they can even teach them. The curriculum mix is extraordinarily important to the success of Telluride. So mixing the stories from people who have experienced these things from all sides, those stories are incredibly powerful. And are the metrics important? Sure, the metrics are important, but, but just to look at a dry balance sheet doesn't compare with listening to the story of a mom who lost her son in an, after an elective operation. I'm of the belief that uh, an organization cannot be what its leader is not. And so we're talking about the C-suite. Involving more C-suite or administrators uh, in this work and in this experience, I think is critical moving forward. In my view, one of the most important elements is the off-site aspect. We get people away from their normal environment. As you get more experience, as you get people who are more inculcated with the way we've always done it, it becomes even more important to take them out of that environment. You're part of a group that has your back. You belong to something that's bigger than yourself. Um, so you have a support net network. So what you're creating is a network of support and collegiality and, and basically a social movement. To bring it all full circle, we need the leadership piece. And that leadership piece is your C-suite, from your CEO, CFO, CNO. But really what it's about is that common belief and passion behind patient safety so that knowing when your patients walk through the door of your hospital they come in with hope and when they leave and walk out of that hospital that promise of hope has been fulfilled. We're trying to build a coalition for change and to build a coalition for change you have to get people out of their home base in an environment where they're surrounded by other people who likewise believe that the world can be made better if we get together, learn how to do it, focus on it, make it happen. So it's just a privilege and a pleasure to be part of it. If every healthcare professional went through the Telluride experience, we wouldn't have the patient harm problem that we have today in healthcare. And that includes hospital administrators, risk managers, people who are actually leading because the culture is set from the top. And healthcare really needs this throughout at every level. NAPA is a unique a uh, special place that uh, see some of these buildings and these businesses, I think is, it's, it's a pretty unique, special place. And it, and it gets, you, gets you thinking differently, and if thinking differently gets us a different way to think about some of what ails us, challenges us in, in healthcare, then it's a good thing.